Good evening, Hot Button Hashtags. My name is Matt. Uh, and I don't know what I'm going to talk about yet. Just sat down and uh, decided I was going to do this video super duper quick. My father-in-law is in town. He and I are going to hang out later and watch Sherlock in my basement. And so I thought I'd film now so I have something to edit. And this is actually a good example of me just jibber-jabbering so I have things to cut out. Because sometimes when you sit down to edit and there's nothing to do, you feel useless. So it's nice to have gaps in the conversation to cut out. What the crap was that? It's probably one of my kids playing with the sliding door. Look! A little butterfly earring. I guess I could talk about my favorite words. In or out? I, I don't think there's really any argument here, and you guys probably agree that hippopotamostros esquipedaliophobia is without question the greatest word in the English language. It describes a fear of large words. If you suffer from hippopotamostros esquipedaliophobia, you can't even talk about it. Like when people say, hey, what's your problem, man? You can't say, oh, I have hippopotamostros esquipedaliophobia. I mean, you, you should say that because it would help you face your fear of long words. But you, you can't because you're afraid to even talk about it. So when people say, hey man, what's your problem? You just say, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. That's, that's a face people make, right? All right. Other favorite words? Uh, glockenspiel. I was... That was a pen. I was going to talk about the recent legalization of same-sex marriage. Um, because who doesn't love a good argument? Somebody just opened the garage door. Or did they close the garage door? And now someone's screaming. Uh, but I don't want to talk about that either. Um, I was going to show you how to start a fire outside in my backyard. Um, but that did not go well. I was going to talk about my Iraqi bayonet, but I think that has actually already been addressed. I posted on Facebook, what should I talk about, on my hot button hashtag video. Let's see what Facebook had to say about it. Two people liked it. That's not helpful. Jaden Knapp suggested that I discuss neatly combed hair compared to the ever-changing mystery of Earth and the rest of the universe. I don't, know, I don't know what that means. Jeff Bain said, What if the Hokey Pokey really is what it's all about? Carrie Hoot. The amount of effort it takes to hang up your towel after a shower versus dropping it on the floor. David Delam Delamarter... Delamarter... De David D. With all the rain, I'd like hot button hashtags to take on the water cycle. Maybe if your house floods, it's nature's way of reclaiming the land for its uses, and you should listen. Uh, favorite apps, uh, movie sequels, specifically why the never ending story needed one. That's a good point, Jason Packelniskis. Why did the never ending story need a sequel? Why couldn't it just be like more of the same movie? I gotta be honest, I actually own. My batteries died in my camera. And in the process of hunting down new ones, um, I forgot what I was talking about. I have this screwdriver. Yeah, this is the worst video ever. This is worse than Adam's cat video. Huh. There's new Angry Birds. This is why... This is why... This is why you need to send in questions. So please just send questions, ask questions, comment questions, email us. We have an email address, it's hotbuttonhashtags at gmail.com. I don't think I've ever mentioned that, but I'm mentioning it right now. <sighs> so please, subscribe and like. Don't like this video. There's no point in liking this video, this video is awful. Like a different video, another one, like the endorphins one. That one's doing very well. That one's actually quite popular right now. Um, the, the one about playing baseball like a girl where I cuss at the end. I apologize for that, by the way. That was that was, that was poor judgment on my part. Like one of Adam's videos. I mean, he really, come on, he tries hard, you guys. He's such a sweetie. Such a sweetie. 